If you've already been using AdWords, you'll probably know what the different match types are. I'm just going to do a quick recap, and if you don't, just a, an introduction really. Um, it's worth bearing in mind that when you actually set up your campaign and you put ads or you put keywords in that you're going to bid on, by default these are set to broad. So broad match basically means where the keywords will um, that you're bidding on, if they appear anywhere within a search term, then your ad will show. So in this first example, we've got women's hats, and as you can see, obviously if somebody types that in, but it also may show for these other, where you've got women's or hats in the title. So it's basically any of these words appearing in any order, anywhere within a search term, then your ad will show. If we look at the next one, we've got phrase match. So this is where when you're entering this as a match type in your campaign, you enclose it in double quotes. So now, women's hats, these two words have to be in the search term and they have to be in that order. So women's and hats, so as you can see, um, these are examples and by the way this particular link will be in the supplementary materials this is Google's own documentation on AdWords so as you can see here it will only show stuff uh, as an example if you put women's baseball bats it won't show because women's and hats is, is not next to each other as it is in the specified in the phrase match and then the next one is exact match and this is where if you're setting up this keyword in your campaign, you put it in square brackets, and this is where it will only match if that actual term is typed in. So as you can see, it'll only, search, it'll only show your ad if someone's actually typed women's hats in. If they add words to the start or the end of the search term, then it won't show. And the negative match, we'll go into more detail on a, another video.